Welcome to my chambers. No one, no one in his right mind wants to see shootings in schools. No one in his right mind wants to see innocents killed by crazy people, just as all of us saw last week in Parkland, Florida. The issue is not do we want this to continue. The issue is how do we stop it? I'm of the view that gun control doesn't work, that bad people will always get guns, that murderous thugs will find a way to kill, and the only way to stop them is with superior firepower. The American government has created gun-free zones. These are places where it's like shooting fish in a barrel. Schools are gun-free zones, and the killers know that. But if we adopted the Israeli model, where three or four or five teachers in the school quietly and stealthily carry firearms, concealed firearms, on which they train every weekend, there would be enough firepower to resist the killer. There was a hero. There were many heroes in Parkland, but the one that sticks in my memory is the very large, very jovial, very much beloved football coach. He became a hero by throwing his body on top of the students, and it was the size and weight and girth of his body that actually deflected bullets and saved the students' lives. But if he had had a handgun, instead of throwing himself on those students, he could have rushed the killer while pulling his trigger. That would have stopped the killer in his tracks, and that would have saved far more lives. Welcome to my chambers. Fight the good fight. Fire, fire, fire.